Odell Beckham Jr. and the New York Giants are rumored to be having some issues. This past year, the New England Patriots were reportedly more than willing to take him off their hands. In fact, according to Chris Sims on PFT Live, they were so aggressive in trade talks that the Giants ultimately chose to back off their efforts to trade their star wide receiver. Talking to Mike Florio of Pro Football Talk, Sims reports that the Giants were prepared to move Beckham in a trade and that the team who was trying the hardest to try and acquire him was the Patriots, which apparently spooked New York into thinking about a trade, the New England Patriots were trying to get Odell Beckham Jr. All last offseason, Sims said. That didn't work out, and I think the Giants got cold feet and said, wait, New England wants him? Oh, maybe he's better than we thought. Maybe we should just keep him on our own instead of it being thrown in our face and him going to win a Super Bowl with the Pats. Sims' statement come on the heels of the Athletics' Jay Glazer reporting that he expects the Giants to try and trade Beckham this offseason. Meanwhile, the reported second-guessing on trade talks speak volumes about Bill Belichick and his apparent mystique on the trade market. Belichick has a long history of trading for problematic players and then turning them into stars in New England while their former teams watch them play in Super Bowls. It started when Belichick traded for then-disgruntled Bengals running back Corey Dillon before the 2004 season. In 2007, Belichick acquired Randy Moss, who was deemed a malcontent with the Raiders and Wes Welker, who was overlooked in Miami, before turning them into stars. More recently, the Patriots acquired Josh Gordon on the cheap from the Browns, turning him into their number one receiver within a few weeks. On defense, Belichick acquired Kyle Van Noy, Akib Tlaib, Jason McCourty and Akeem Hicks all on the cheap before turning them into valuable contributors. Gordon Deal wound up burning the Patriots when he was indefinitely suspended once again by the end of the regular season. Still, Belichick appears to have built up enough of a track record where, if he's got his eyes on a player, other teams are going to start wondering why. Here's the full clip of Sims talking to Florio.